Hey, what's up guys? Justin here back bringing you another trade day and this one's going to be very quick only like four or five hours It's going to end around 12 a.m. Just around there So you guys have around three and a half hours to send in trades So we're gonna see how fast we can do it But hopefully you guys are still up to send in trades for these top right wingers in the game so far Obviously not counting legend cards and not counting uh, the really high expensive uh, Milestone cards, but these are all the typical uh, base cards that you can buy for very very not too, it's not too expensive, but not too cheap. So let's show you the players I have up. First of all, you can ignore TJ Oshie. I will throw him up, but I'm going to put a buy now on him. So if you do find him in the market, maybe you might just want to buy him. But first of all, we have Corey Perry, 92 overall, right wing sniper. And people love him because he's huge too, right? 6'3", 212. He's got some hands on him. A 91 shooting, 90 hands. Oh, Jesus. Corey Perry is up the first player with the highest overall in this trade block. Then we got Filthy Phil Kessel. 90 overall, very popular player, not too expensive nowadays, he's only around 75, well actually a little bit more expensive than that, around 80 to 85k, however you guys know his stats are amazing, not as good as Corey Perry's in terms of checking in defense, but Phil Kessel, 82, 83 defense, but 90, 91, 92 in skating, shooting, and hands uh, respectively, so it's pretty good as well. Then moving on uh, to an 89 overall, and you guys know Patrick Kane, one of the most expensive 89 overalls you can get in this game. Worth around 200000 as well, and he is on the Chicago Blackhawks. Uh, these guys are all on the original teams, Anaheim, Phil Kessel, except for Patrick Kane and Marion Hosa, you'll see here. But Patrick Kane, he is on the Chicago Blackhawks, a right wing playmaker. He's got some nifty mittens. 94 hands on him as well, so he's up as well for another five hours. And then we got Marion Hosa also on the Chicago Blackhawks, one of the best two-way forwards in the game with a 91 overall rating, and he is also up for as well. Only worth around 75k, so pretty cheap as well. And last but not least, for those lower end people, uh, I mean lower end trading, uh, I also have a Brian Gianna up there as well. Uh, I just found him in my collection. I thought, you know what? It's not the top. 20 defense but you know what brian gianna not a bad milestone card and i probably will accept the best offer i get on him so as long as you guys send in a fair deal or a little bit less you might have a pretty good chance of getting brian gianna for those people that need a little bit of coinage right but uh we got all these players up i will check them at around 12 a.m tonight so you got to send them in asap once you see this video and hopefully the thumbnail you saw was pretty nice that you guys might enjoy but anyways thanks for watching Hopefully you guys send in some trades. I will be making the trade day results in time this time. I'll still rush myself a little bit, uh, but uh, I won't leave it till the last like three minutes like last time, all right? Anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will catch you guys in the trade day results. See you guys.